Hi and welcome to free Excel tutorial videos. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can add in option buttons in your Excel form. Okay, in my previous video, I have showed you how you can add in um, spin buttons as well as a checkbox um, to uh, create a loan calculation scenario. So today we will take the same scenario and what we're going to do is we're going to create three option buttons to define how much loan we are going to borrow and this loan amount will depend on our down payment so I want to create a three option of down payment okay so first things first is let's go to the developer tab and go to the option I'm, I'm sorry go to the insert and the first thing we want to do is to create um, the group box so just select the form control group box and just draw it okay just draw it like this and uh, let's give it a new name let's name it uh, let's call this down payment okay so now we have the group box what we want to do next is to add in the option button so once again go to the insert and uh, use the form control okay not the active x control so here the option button is right here okay so once again we will draw it and there we have it option button so once we have the first one we can copy and paste the second one so uh, so just right click copy ctrl C and ctrl V and ctrl V again you'll get the third one okay it's a really simple feature so that you know we can uh, have it align so now we have our three option um, buttons and um, what we want to do now is to add a cell link so right click go to format control and for the cell link just let's select this cell over here click ok and once you do that you will apply it to all the other three as you can see this is the first option this is the second option and this is the third option okay let's just move this a little bit okay so now let's come inside here and change the text so let's edit text let's call this 5% down okay and the second one let's call it 10% down and the third one this one let's do 20% okay so now the option buttons are ready and option 1 is 5% option 2 is 10% down payment option 3 is 20% so now let's come over to this cell over here this loan cell this is the cell that's going to tell us how much that we are going to borrow based on our down payments option that we choose so for this one, this cell, we're going to use a function. We're going to use the choose function. So let's type equals choose tap to function autocomplete. Let's bring up the function argument. Use control A. And the index number, the first argument will be this cell over here. Okay. So for value number one, we're going to use refer to the purchase price which is cell B3 and we are going to multiply it by parentheses 1 minus 0 0.05 close parentheses okay for value number 2 we're going to refer again to the purchase price multiply it by a bracket 1 minus 0 
zero point one zero um, to um, to tell the formula that we are going to pay ten percent down payment, and for the value number three, uh, do the same. Refer to this cell over here and multiply it by bracket one minus zero point two zero and close parenthesis. So just double check your formulas. Make sure there is no double parenthesis. And now let's click OK. So now we have uh, the option buttons integrated into the loan calculation. So for a purchase price of 400,000 and a down payment of 5%, the loan amount that we're going to take is 380,000. Okay? So for a 10% down payment, we will be taking a 360% loan and for a 20% down payment we will be taking a 320,000% loan okay so that is how you can add in option buttons in your excel form so i hope you like the video i will see you in the next video